Back on TYT Sports, locked out here in Culver City, California. The Olympics are right around the corner. There are many Olympic trials going on throughout the United States. The swimming trials that occurred yesterday in Omaha. Dara Torres competed and unfortunately finished fourth. So she will not be making her sixth appearance in the Olympics. Dara Torres, an incredibly impressive resume. However, yesterday finishing fourth in the 50 meter freestyle in 24 point two eight two seconds nine hundredths from second place again that is twenty four point eight two seconds she was quoted as saying this is really over that's it i'm going to enjoy some time with my daughter have a nice summer and cheer on the united states team from afar mentally it's been so tough the past couple of years with having more bad workouts than good workouts and going to meets and not being able to go faster at night than i did in the morning the 45-year-old Dara Torres, a 12-time Olympic medalist, appeared in five Olympics, the first American ever to do so. Uh, a Cuban-American won five medals at the Sydney Olympics, three in Beijing. The oldest female swimmer ever is Dara Torres. Also, uh, the names that you might not know who finished in front of her, at least uh, compared to Dara Torres' name and how big of a star she has become competing in five Olympics. Uh, the ones that finished in front of her, Jessica Hardy, 25 years old, won the event in 24.5 seconds. That is the Olympic swimming trials in 24.5 seconds. Carol Lynn Joyce, 26 years old, finished uh, in a time of 24.73 seconds. A few notables that did not make the team, Amanda Beard and Katie Hoff. So let us know your thoughts on all this. You can always tweet those at me, at Rick Strom. Best ones get read on the air. Our Facebook page is in the description below. Leave your comments in the comments section below. And also, please do us a favor. We will be covering the Olympics throughout the entire time. Uh, all the countries are in London. So if you're looking for coverage, come back to TYT Sports. And please do us a favor. Subscribe to the channel.